Good morning guys, so this day of surgery is 6 in the morning. My appointment was originally set for 9.30 to arrive at the surgical center, but I was called to come in now, so it's time to get ready. Alright guys, so we're on our way to the clinic. Havana Plastic Surgery. Here we come. Yeah. Alright guys, so I was just dropped off at Havana Plastic Surgery. So let's check if it's open because it's really early. Nope, it's not, right? Because I see girls on the other side. <laughs> Buenos dias. All right, guys, so this time. Ay, Dio. All right. Como un poquitico de orina, sí. Un poquitico. Sí. Okay. All right. Drug test. I'm patient number two. I feel excited now. I'm not even nervous. Sí, ven. Sí, pero más bien, mira, necesito que te cambies de ropa uh -huh. y para que te hagas una foto. Pones todas tus ropitas y todas tus cosas aquí. Ok. Estos son unas medias de compresión. Ok. Bien, una bata abierta para atrás. ¿Oíste? Ok. ¿Y me tengo que poner las medias de compresión ahora? Sí, ahora mismo. Así, así mismo. Ahora súbelo. Así, no importa si, si por subo la hasta arriba. El doctor viene enseguida a ver. ¿Oíste? Yo soy la primera paciente de él. La segunda. Oh, ok, pensé que sí. era Dr. Mamanas. Ahí está, Dr. Mamanas, gracias. Eh, sí, Moriria es el que está. Mamanas que tuvo un problema. Oh, es el que me va a Sí. Ah, Dr. Moriria. Sí. Ok. Es súper bueno, igual que Mamanas. Ok, no me lo, como no me lo habían dicho. Sí, ya, él, sí, pero es súper, súper, súper. Okay. ok. Sí, ya, okay. All right, so my doctor is not here. Dr. Marie, um, Dr. Memeniscus. So I'm going to be operated on by Dr. Marie. So, oh snap, this broke. So the doctor will be in shortly. I am the second case of the day, so we shall see. All right guys, so I'm ready. I have my compression socks my slippers it's already cold and I'm, i haven't even reached the operating room so they did the drug test and they asked me to change you have to pay any remaining balance and whatever so i'm just waiting so again my doctor Memeniscus is not here he's out but dr Meridian is going to be performing the bbl and the tummy tuck on me so i'm actually pretty excited so in a little bit he's going to come and do the markings and everything and then we're going back Guys, I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually pretty excited. So we will see. I am really excited. So hey guys, um, 
Again, Dr. Meridian is doing my surgery and I call him the sexy doctor. Person, we'll see when he comes in and does all my markings. So I'm excited, I'm excited. I don't feel, I don't really feel nervous or maybe I'm excited because I'm nervous. I'm not sure, but I am really excited. I feel calm, I guess because I have a great support team behind me. And I'm just thankful for all of them that are praying for me and covering me. And I'm just, I'm just blessed to have the family I have and the friends that I have. So thank you to all of you. What are you saying now, Iron? Iron. Iron. Mm-hmm. So what are you getting done? Uh, Brazilian butt lift, um, tummy tuck, tuck, and I'm getting lipo right here and okay. the auxiliary. All right. Guys, so Dr. Moraine is right next door. I can hear him talking and I am getting nervous because it is getting real. This is happening. Oh my god, it's crazy. But right, here we go. Oh my god. Thanks. You're that needle was so big. Holy cow. That is a huge needle. I don't even want to touch it. It's freaking huge. <sighs> so real my arm is freezing she says just to stay um, hydrated but I haven't even got my markings yet so I'm still waiting and I'm already cold like it's cold so be aware that you're going to be freezing nice to see this part of my arm is pink or red and it's extremely cold, so I had to rub it because it's, uh, it's hurting a little bit. It's kind of burning. And I'm actually done with my IV. It is completely done. So I think the flow was really fast. So it just, it's so cold, it kind of burns, it hurts. So I have to like rub it a little bit. Yep. Morning. Hey. Hi. How are you doing, Dr. Nice Good. to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, they tell you what's going on. I'm trying to help you out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's okay with you? Yeah, perfect. I actually wanted you originally. Oh, okay. Thank you. <laughs> So it worked out. Uh, yeah. Let me just put this here. Well, so, so tell me about this. So where are you from? I'm from Orlando. Oh, you are? Yeah. Okay, me too. Yeah, well, where? Um, I'm actually, I bought a house in Apopka, so. Apopka? Yeah. Uh, famous in Winter Springs. Um, very good. And uh, how old are you? I'm 32. Last week, I turned 32. Ooh. This is like, gift. Yes, this is the biggest gift. Very good. What do you do for work? I'm um, actually a data analyst for a health insurance company. Very good. So we are doing a, a tummy tuck? Yes. What do you want me to tuck? <laughs> mm. oh, son. Yeah. You don't have much. I mean, I guess I could. I guess I'd do it. You know, you're not bad. You're not bad. You know, so what am I thinking in my head? Um, tummy tuck and BBO. You know, I don't like to do them together. Right? I know. Okay. I know. You said no. Yeah. I had a consultation. Oh, okay. All right. There you go. So, yeah, it can you know, lead to a problem. The only thing is you are not a bad candidate because you're young, you're healthy. When they told me your weight, 
I was no. like, okay, maybe I'll do this one. Yeah. You know, because I really don't like to do. I you know. know. People, or you've seen, you're obviously mm -hmm. just from you know talking to you again. And you're a bright girl, you know. So <laughs> you're gonna probably, you're gonna take care of yourself. It was something yeah. else I was worried. The only thing is, you know, are you a candidate for it or not? Have you had kids? I have three kids. Holy shit. And I'm done having kids. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. You know, I mean, we don't mind trying it. Yeah. You know, I, mean, I, I know I can do it. I know I can do it. It's just, it's just the healing process after. Yeah. I can't control it. Up to you. Right. Okay. You know, you're laying your tummy. This opens up. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not gonna be laying on my tummy. So. You're gonna be laying your butt. I'm in a recovery home for the next eight days. Okay. How are you gonna be sleeping? They're gonna put me in a recliner and the one that gave you the pillows underneath here. I'm okay. just stuffed up with pillows. All right. Okay. So I know. Let me see. You really do have a good shape. You really look good. Um, okay, right, let's do it. I'll do it. Fuck. And then um, I have um, these little Our feet. Yeah. Yeah. I so really what I just wanted in like I was like oh my god I just want my tummy tuck and this is like hate these two things you know because um, but I was like but I'm not to fill in my head so I'm like okay hey, let's do it all. No problem. Thank you so much. Appreciate. Okay. We'll probably do an augmentation only. You know, we need to live. Yeah. So this, you know, I think this is gonna re respond to lipo. You yeah. know, some people would say maybe excise it. Did you get an ultrasound here? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. It was normal. Yeah. And you guys have a copy of it. And I have, I've had um, C-section, I'm sorry, yeah, C-section, so I have a previous scar down there. Yeah, that's so really nice. Yeah, so I just hoping to keep that same. I'm going below it, let me get rid of it. All right. Mm -hmm. And I'm hoping to get a cute belly button. <laughs> Some people don't know I got that so <laughs> Yeah, I mean, let me just recreate this one, basically. Yeah. Um, okay, you know your back is really good. <laughs> so after surgery you're gonna be in pain right yeah make sure you're walking not okay. a surgery okay mm -hmm. walk 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 the more walking you do the better the result okay but just say one second I'll just look at it. um walk 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 okay the more walking you do the better the result and less pain you'll have okay okay After massages daily, the first yeah. week, and then after that, um, two to three massages per week for two to three months. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Um, I have five massages with here, and okay. then, um, do you guys recommend more than one a day? Mm, yeah, you can. Okay, because I'm going to get some at the recovery home too, especially on Sunday since you guys are not open. Yeah, that's a good idea. The more the better. And your skin, I mean, you're going to look very good after. You're going to look great. You should look even better. You know, you got to work with some. Everything's fine. I'm excited to do you. I'm excited for you to do it, baby. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Right, let me see. Let me see if I can get more time. It's a wall for me. Sure. That's good. And then, uh, perfect. And then facing that way. Uh, go like this. Yeah, perfect. And you back towards me. That's good. Yeah. Beautiful. And then facing the recliner. Smart girl. Uh, no, that's good. No, no, that's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay. Okay, so what am I gonna do? So here, mm -hmm. lipo there, lipo there. Mm -hmm. Okay, here really hit your waist hard. Bring it in, bring it in. You have a great shape mm -hmm. already. Lipo, good. 
minimize the glove handles, flat to your hips there. Yep. Your ass is already in pretty good shape, so that makes it much, much easier to do this surgery. Um, where you're a better candidate. Like the name, two sets slope there. Get the butt to expand. And then here, uh, essentially everything from here down, gone. So you have nice and tight, do a muscle wall repair. And then lap with your sides and lap with the midline. Okay. Woo, all right. <laughs> okay, sounds good. Sounds good. Yeah. Yep. No, actually, so you look at that like um, I look at the reports I work with. Oh really? <laughs> so yeah, no, it's just interesting, yeah. you know. By March, that's I really don't do how much we go together. I always train never to do it together because it's just it's a headache for the patient, stuff like that. Um, but well, I appreciate you doing. So you seem like the okay. perfect kind of dude. Can I ask you any medical problems? You said no. No. And then allergies? No. No? And then uh, medications, nothing? Nothing. Smoke, drink? Nope. Nothing. And then surgery, C-section? Yeah, I had a C-section. I had my tubes removed. Okay. A bilateral tube ligation? Yeah. And then any problems with anesthesia? No. Okay. And then, um, okay. All right, so back to surgery, what are you doing? Oh, walking. Walk, walk, walk. Walk, walk, Thank you so much. I'm excited to be, I already know, bye. <laughs> Thank you. All right, guys, so that's it. Those are my markings. I'm gonna get ready to go into surgery soon. So I'm just so excited. He's going to do my surgery. So, you know, this is staining. You know, he doesn't do multiple procedures at once, and uh, I feel really lucky that he's going to do this on me. So I, I'm i really excited. So if I don't get to see or record another video, I'll record while when I'm done with the surgery. So, all right, guys, there you have it. Dr. Meridian. All right, guys, so we reached our recovery house, and... Where there's a lot of blood. I'm extremely cold and uh, and a lot of pain. But I'm gonna get some rest. Hi guys. I feel a little better, just a little bit better now. Um it feels like you got hit by a train or a car or that you got jumped by like a hundred people. Um, but I'm okay so far. Recovering. I went to the bathroom earlier and I almost passed out. Because as long as you're like laying down and you're surrounded by pillows, you're pretty much okay. But... If you get up and try to walk or something, your body's too weak. I'm draining a lot, so I'm just losing a lot of fluid. And um, I can barely hold the phone up, so. But I'm bleeding a lot. There's blood everywhere. Just want to show you guys. We just emptied these out not too long ago. And there's I'm assuming it's the same way on my back but I haven't really thought about it much I'll stay like this probably till tomorrow honestly you don't even care it doesn't even bother you because you're in so much pain the heart the pain that i feel the most is my abdominal wall um all the way up here it's like sewn and then i haven't seen anything so we'll see but thank you so much for staying tuned
I'll keep you I'll try to keep you guys posted as much as I can it's just really hard but thank you oh and I haven't taken any medications at all it's hard to be in a recliner and keeping your butt off the actual chair it's not very doable um, but I'm managing but it hurts like my back hurts and my butt hurts Oof. but I'm glad to see I have a little more color in my face because I was pale 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 so they gave me apple juice and they gave me blended soup these girls are taking such a good care of me. I'm so thankful for them. I'm so glad I did not go to an Airbnb or a hotel. You guys, if you're planning on having stuff like this, come to a recovery home because you will need the assistance. All right, guys, I'll keep you guys posted. Guys, this is Mimi. You can barely see her, but they take really, really good care of us here. Soup. <laughs> Hi guys, so I took my medications and I'm getting drowsy, so I'm going to sleep. I'll keep filming today was surgery day, so ah, I'm feeling better every hour. Thank you so much for watching and I'll keep you posted. Bye.